welcome guys welcome to today's lesson on start pro connect edition today we shall be designing the combined part base so the first thing we do on this model since i've loaded the model so first thing we do is to run our analysis again run analysis zero errors zero one in one nodes so go to post processing to see our reaction so these are our reactions so next thing we do is foundation design on pin this place select all load combination or click include all start foundation advance then it begins so why wait for it okay Okay, so from this, we can see we have eight foot things. I want to combine it, so we're going to combine it like this. And you can also, you can only combine in the same axis. You can combine in different axes. So first thing we do is job setup, create new job. So let me expand this. Sorry. So give it the name you want. Uh, combined job type. Select combined here combined design code british unit si okay yes the next thing is include all then create job so after creating job you now combine the two columns you're interested one two so you combine it create so it's telling me that because i selected this one so you thought it was part so Hold this with um, press control key for multiple selection. So this to create select no yes. Similar to this, create okay. Hold control key for multiple selection. Create, um, create okay. Next thing we do is come here. You can see combined footing job here. Okay. Design parameter. So we set the parameter similar to that of um, um, isolated part bees. So concrete reinforcement 24. I'm using unit width of concrete as 24. Minimum bar spacing 50 450. So you can follow my parameters. Then cover and soil. Similar to you can follow my parameters. Okay. So footing geometry. Um sorry. I want to make this uh let's say 500. Let's say 500.5. Point five, so point five, okay. So you can adjust anything you are interested in. Okay, put as default, yes. Okay. Next thing you do is go to column eccentricity. I want my column to be at the center of the part base, so zero zero zero. Okay. Then sliding and overturning. So these are the factor of seat safety for sliding and overturning then this is the coefficient of friction 0 0.4 all these values you can get them from your soil report so whatever your soil report gives you you can change it to suit it okay the next thing we do is design okay so this is our design you can see it kept bottom boots bottom and top reinforcements okay so this is it this is the calculation sheet you can export it out this is the bending moment diagram so we kept stop reinforcements here for hugging moments so so this is for hugging moments and this is the one we share okay so for then check for point change share check okay so this is the calculation sheet that's giving us reinforcement c12 as 360 so you can come back to your geometry this is your geometry you can bring out your detail and schedule drawing so this is for footing one footing two three and four okay next you can bring out your schedule drawing also then your ga drawing you can bring out your ga drawing okay then print out your calculation sheets okay 
so thank you for watching today's video on star pro connect edition please make sure you subscribe and if you have any comments you can drop it in the comment section or any problem you can drop it in the comment section thank you very much for watching